By way of comparison, the Syracuse City Schools are doing better than Rochester, but not as good as Buffalo. More than half of the students in the district are graduating, and that's a huge improvement over a few years ago. Syracuse City School District has a lot to be happy about. Graduation rates are improving. The dropout rate has also decreased from 27% to 16%. Brian Nolan is the executive director of high schools for Syracuse City School District. He says the increase is because of the new strategies, including keeping a closer eye on how each student is doing. Instead of waiting till June when you get the result and, oh, well, you know, the student didn't pass, what happened? They, they were right on top of it week to week, month to month on what needed to be adjusted with the, with the learning that was going on in the class and the teaching that was going on in the class. The school district was on a priority school list from both the federal government and the state government, resulting in targeted funding for the school. But it's the teacher-student relationship that's been the most vital part for the schools. And the students um, feel like th there is that connection at the, in the classroom, at the school, that people know who I am. People, you know, think that it's important that I'm here. Now, Brian Nolan says since they started this new approach, graduation rates have steadily improved. Their goal is to get to a 75% graduation rate in the future. He says this process is only the beginning. Matt?